Hello everyone, this is my December update and it will be the last update of the year. Maybe next year I'll make it a, well maybe on New Year's I'll make it a New Year's resolution to do end of the year list, but for this year this will be my last video. Now, let's get started. I'll start off with a bang. Iron Maiden, peace of mind. This is a 2014 reissue of a 1983 classic. Just marvelous that they're reissuing all these records because some of us missed out. We were so young. And... And then I think a first press of this album isn't too much, but the band. All right. And the next album I'm going to show Alice Cooper. Greatest Hits, just like the Iron Maiden album. I picked this up at my half-price bookstore. The Iron Maiden album was completely new. So, and yeah, the, I don't care if you know what I paid for it. The sleeve and the record is in are both in very good condition. And you, the price on Discogs is the same. So, and this is a first press. Oh, this inspired Motley Crue, Guns N' Roses, Poison, Twisted Sister. So, I'm glad to have this to add to my collection. I have it on CD. I had it on cassette tape years ago. My mom made me buy it. Anyhow, getting on to CDs. A Life Divided. This is a gothic rock album. Um, I haven't listened to it yet. I have it on my had it on my wish list at uh, Discogs. So. Hopefully pulling the trigger on this will be worth it. I'm sure it will. Alright. Up next. Metallica. Back with the symphony again. Alright. They do songs off their newest album with the symphony. And on the second disc... Oh, the intro. Skivvy and Suit. The enemy. And. The enemy God and the Dance of the Dark Spirits. Yeah. Yeah, the set. Those were the symphony's ideas. The first three tracks. First three to five, it appears. But those were the... They were the symphony's ideas, and... The symphony knows what the fuck they're doing. Alright, next one to show is Six Feet Under Torment, which I've been waiting for years to get, and I finally have it. I do not have the newest album from Six Feet Under, but... Hey, I will be getting it, because I'm really loyal to the band. Saw him in concert, February 14th, 1998. And the final product I will show this evening is 
Midnight, Rebirth by Blasphemy. I fucking love Midnight. Alright. I know that update was a little short. So now I'm going to get on to the election. 41 appeals filed by the Trump administration. All of them have lost. Trump's lawyers are dropping out. Election officials in states like Georgia, Arizona, and Wisconsin. <sighs> the, those states are, are not left-wing states. And the officials would not just sit back and let Biden win if the votes weren't legitimate. Top Republicans have called for him to concede. John Bolton, John Kelly, even his son-in-law. And it's not like Trump did a good job. His foreign policy was the worst. He did nothing about the Saudis assassinating that journalist. The pro-Zionist agenda was just revolting. He loved all the dictators. Erdogan. Putin, Kim Jong-un, the newly elected president of Brazil. He fucked our relationship with European countries. Early on in his, early in his term, Dr. Sebastian Gorka resigned because he saw this dog and pony show wasn't going to make it. Trump fired his two most competent men, Steve Bannon and Jeff Sessions. And he, he basically took the, he took the teeth out of the CDC. And now here we are in a pandemic. He transferred the CDC's power to the Health and Human Services and then it was transferred to two private companies and people are dying, people are starving, the economy has gone to shit. So it's time for Donald T John Trump to get the fuck out of George Washington's house. Joe Biden won. And that's my final video for the year. Thank you all and good night.